Welcome to the 21st century. <laughs> you didn't even notice that he was doing that. It's part of my life. Another day, another vlog. We're going to cost it. What's it called? Co op. Co op. We're going to co op because we got no water yesterday, we had no food yesterday, and we're starving. We went to bed, we? Right. Oh, yeah. Some tuna, can't get it out. Some tuna and a wrap. I pickle every 15 minutes because uh, I make a pickle spiky metabolism. I had a um, tin of tuna every like three hours because you're supposed to have to shoot uh, put meat every three hours. That's what I did, that was about 12 years ago. And then now. Don't lie, you still do it. Still do it now. <laughs> <laughs> and then now. None of that is true, by the way. personal development exercise there for people who are who care too much about what people think about them so you go to a supermarket and you kind of purposely take your time and purposely have a conversation with the person behind the checkout like I just changed some packs from chains to a pound and a queue of people but realistically it's like some people will be rushing and like trying to get it done quick and maybe you're the type of person that cares too much or is like a people pleaser nice personal development exercise just to feel that pressure of the queue building behind you and they're all you feel like they're all looking like, come on hurry up really like, it doesn't matter it's only like an extra 30 seconds of life so it's a good personal development Do you look? Like you got a tent on. This thing, this is becoming a feature of the vlog. It's not even mine, it's yours. <laughs> this is the cool bit. We've got this pass. We just walk straight in. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, you see it. Fantastic. Oh, wicked. 
It's about the support of you guys supporting each other and we just help you because it's more about you than it is about us because it's your journey. Does that answer your question? Anybody else got a question? For either me or Dean? He's running a lot and burning a hell of a lot of calories. Long distance, uh, marathon, half marathon, go. And he wants to know whether you should feel guilty by eating the uh, naughty foods like the cheesecake. So, so this goes into more level two and level three kind of answer. But I'm going to go into it quickly now. We've got about ten minutes left. In level two and level three we start talking about the more detailed stuff on the cake. So we only spoke about calories so far. So as we get more details we start talking about macros. Who knows what macros are? Most people know what macros are. Carbs, fats, proteins, and one of the ones we forget is fiber. Fiber has one of the, is one of the most studied parts of the nutrition, of nutrition that is the biggest marker for health. Thanks for, uh, thanks for listening. Yeah, yeah, sure. Enjoy that. Well, so tell me then. How much does it actually cost? A pound. 
Yeah, but I'm on about, I'm on about all the time. So, it's a pound a toilet. Yeah. You do that for one month. Can you get all of that in detail again? For a month. Yeah. For a month. And after that, it's ten pound per month. Well, yeah, we're, a, we're a social enterprise. We're a charity. We're a charity based organisation because of the shit that I went through that bad eight years. Right. We've okay. set this up to be able to help people like you and help people like these guys and stuff like that. But take this away with you if you want and, uh, yeah, and have a look. I've got one of them, but I've got one of them. Because I have, like I said, it was probably it was Britain's top bodybuilder. I've got a, a partner at the time who was a doctor in nutrition and science. The measured me, the weighed me, the monitored me every week and I did not lose anywhere for six weeks. And I was paying £30 pound a week. So, what the question to you is, it's not about mindset, because I did it. Right. And it was very hard, because in fact, I thought I was eating too much. So it sounds like, the biggest thing of what we just spoke about then was the calorie deficit. So it that sounds point. like you were simply eating a little bit too many calories for your body. Yeah, probably, probably. So there needs to be adjustment all the time. I, mean, I am actually losing it. So, but that's a so slow. And, and the type of food I eat, I don't eat greens. So, you said that earlier, yeah. yeah so it's, you can work around all that. Yeah, do because a diet you, plan, just, just do. you you choose the foods. So the idea is that you choose what it is you like to eat. So you then, what we spoke about earlier, you get my fitness pal. You get used to it. It takes time. You type in there. I like to eat. I don't know. You, you think I like to eat like whatever? Uh, what's one of your foods you eat quite regularly? Rice. Yeah, you yeah, type, rice, yeah, yeah, You rice. type in rice, you find out how many calories it is. Week one, it does take ages. It like, might be 20 minutes a day. Week two, you go, rice, done. Week three, you go, press R, and it finds yeah, yeah, rice yeah, for yeah, you, yeah, done. Yeah, got, got and you get quicker and quicker and quicker. So if you fancy not rice, you fancy sweet potato, you go, sweet potato. So then what happens then is it's more personalized to what you, your taste buds want yeah. on that moment. And yeah. that's basically what we teach throughout the, the, the several days, you know. Um, but yeah, have a try. Have a little listen. You'll we'll take you through that in a more chilled out, like yeah. two or three minute video yeah. content, and that's how it works and steps upon itself. Have a look on that little board over there. That's got like the, the structure of all the videos as well. I like this. How are they doing? Uh, you right? Joseph. Nice to meet you. Um, Jordan said he put us on to you. So you are from PT Wars. PT Wars, yeah. Tell me about PT Wars, what is it? Yeah, so me and the guys are promoting at the moment as we do fitness competitions for personal trainers to compete against each other. At the moment, we've noticed the industry's growing that much. Uh, what's the next level of personal trainers? So you've got a full client base, you've got a good income, you've got smart doing, but you might not be able to some of them go to fitness modeling. Some of the other ones to do powerlifting championships, so we're bringing something else to the table where we'll help profile them. Right. Um, we're able to raise uh, exposure for them through sponsors, our events itself, okay. linking them to other companies and events like this. So potentially next year we come down with a stall and showcase our personal trainers like our ambassadors. Okay. So they're using the orange. She's our, one of our main girls. Okay. Um, she's actually from the Widow. Really? Okay. Yeah, yeah. My name, you know, Mark Rice. Yeah. He's one of our lads. I'd definitely be interested in getting involved, especially with the gym. Yeah. Um, I'm wondering. Well, so I've only really heard about yourselves over the last few months. Um, I'm waiting for Faye getting involved in the middle as well. Right, okay. We saw they looked over that side, what else is over there? You can come over, you're more than welcome to come over and like, try the gym out. Yeah. That's, that's cool. We'll have a little training session or whatnot. Yeah. But um, I'm thinking about Empowered by Eating as well, due to do like connections with the PTs. What PTs are doing is going, you're a PT yourself, right? Yeah. So when a client comes to you for your nutrition, you're trying to sort the nutrition out, you're trying to sort the training out, you're trying to sort the minds out around nutrition, and then you're just like, uh, and you're trying to do that in an hour while training, and then you're like, what most PTs are doing is going, go to your pound by eating as a pound. Right, let's now talk about your training. So there is uh, potentially a commission structure that can be put in place there with a reoccurring income for the PT. So we got one PT who's on like, he gets like 25 or 50 pound a month just oh, from nice. sending clients to it, yeah. um, which is nice because it obviously supports your job a little bit better. So you are, so you are the, um, what is it, the ambassador? Yeah. So me and Mark, we're in competition for what? Personality, social media personality of the year. Yeah, the best personal trainer, isn't it? I'm sure we're doing too. I'm not a personal trainer, man. Not oh, personal, no. I, I may be. Gym, haven't you? Gym, yeah. Sure, yeah. Best social media personality of the year. Yeah. So if you want to go and vote for me or Mark on my vlog, 
to walk up or help me not be
Are you ready to go? Here's you. Wine again. I said today, why doesn't your baby cry? Because <laughs> it never cries, and now it's crying. Oops. I sat there for the whole time in your house, just like watching the hospital game, just playing. Yeah, I was fat. Body power today. Absolutely amazing. What do you think about it? Amazing. It was just amazing. Just amazing. Just amazing. It was really good. It was funny that we were educating about drinking alcohol and eating out, and we're drinking alcohol and eating out right now. Don't worry. Be safe. Oh my god. This was. Hahaha. Just turn left. Craig, thanks for your email. Many thanks for coming by the stand and taking part. We're here to help you every step of the way. Sat on thanks the again. Girl. Is that who it is, yeah. Craig? That guy. Okay, hi Dean. You and Chris are truly among the greats. Um, I can only imagine the troubles and challenges you guys face when taking on and uh, demystifying nutritional truths. I encourage you guys to keep on going. I'm glad you um, put on the stand so I can attend the event. Thanks again. I need a lot of handhold as I need to become better with my understanding of the diet cake. I'm working on the concept daily and weekly until I build up my wires strong enough to keep the weight off. Many thanks again and best wishes, Craig. Who's so nice. so, Remember the guy who was on the film when we were, when we were talking today? On the left hand side. Uh, Thank you. Yeah. Oh, is that not a... Uh, what's that? Is that an email? It's, it's an email. It's an email. He came up to the stand, right, and I said, do you want to like enter our competition and that guess the calories? And he went, I haven't got a clue about calories. Uh, so I went, we'll just take a guess. I went in fast. They're actually starting a uh, seminar now. Being coached by the bodybuilder. If you right, want to go okay. and have a look. Exactly and he goes, right. really? And he, I went, yeah. I said, go and, go and have a look. Go and see what you've learned and then come back to me at the end. Yeah. So he sat in. He, he, I think he asked you questions. And then he came back to me yeah. and said, I still don't know. He said that was an eye opener. He said, I haven't got a clue. And he was, he was, um, he, put, he, he actually entered in the end. And he got two things. Mm -hmm. How many? Yeah, yeah, he actually done a good guess. And I said, He's been, he's worked with what he believes to be like a really successful bodybuilder coach, but just got no results. Right? else said, he said one of his mates has got a nutrition stand and he was going to go there first, but he's glad he'd been to use because he was going to go and buy into their program. Yeah, and he didn't. Well, that's, 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 that's mine, I think. Mm -hmm. top, the top of the glasses, right? Cheers. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. He said that his calorie. Uh, he said that it, it stayed the same weight for six weeks. Mm -hmm. like, so what does that sound like to you? Mm -hmm. And he moved forty five minutes. Like, sound like what? He left it again. There you go. Uh, so, so, so you have to just need to reduce a little bit. That's what you're trying to do. So nice. What's the stuff in there? Lovely guy. Yeah, he was dead nice. Top of the glass was wet. Is that nice? Yeah. I'm gonna check the top. Second glass of wine. Second glass of wine like this. Yeah. Yeah. Yours is what? Okay. That looks nice. Um. Mm -hmm. Can I get any garlic or chili oil or are you okay? Can I get something from underneath this leg? Like, just on the <laughs> yeah. I, I, Can I, I get like, some? I like the sound of the garlic or chili oil. Yes, please. Yeah. Garlic oil, please. 
we'll feature yeah, everyone's we'll pizza one by one. Can you guess what one's the beans like? <laughs> <laughs> everyone looks happy. Yeah. We have pizza. I'm gonna try this. <laughs> welcome, to the welcome, welcome to the 21st century. <laughs> you didn't even notice that he was doing that. It's part of my life. I don't even know him. I don't know who he is. He just Never follows me around with a camera. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you got him? Yeah. Yeah. What, what are you going to do, what what you gonna do with the yogurt? Just topping up my protein. I want to eat the yogurt. Yeah, and what are you going to do with the lid? <laughs> I'm going to lick the lid. <laughs> this is just for Joe. Go right? on. Keep going, keep going. This is just, just for Joe to end the vlog. If you open the yogurt, right? Like this, <laughs> in the middle of the street. If you lick the lid, ah, that has no calories. <laughs> <laughs>